Thank you, Jim. Well, two men in North County found a way to help small businesses and frontline workers thrive during this pandemic, all with a click of a button. In this story that is positively San Diego, ABC 10 News reporter Vanessa Paz shows us how their new website saved one local restaurant owner while helping feed local heroes. Orange Corner in Carlsbad is no exception to COVID-19's effects. I lost one of my location out of my three location. Uh, then I completely closed essentially by the end of March. Alexandra Long is the owner. Everything had to be resyncing and resought. Slowly opening doors back up, business was slow until she met Dave and Bruce. I thought maybe creating a website where locals are donating, giving money to local restaurants to buy meals for people working on the front lines. Bruce is a computer designer, Dave in sales, and together they created Feeding Local Heroes, a website where people can buy meals from their favorite local restaurants to donate to frontline workers. Hospitals or assisted living facilities, blood banks. We wanted to put more of a personal touch on it and let you decide what your favorite restaurant is, donate whatever you, whatever you, meals you like from that restaurant. The service delivery and doll is completely free for restaurants. Purely to add revenue to the restaurants and provide meals for the recipient heroes. So far, Feeding Local Heroes has partnered with 13 restaurants in North County and delivers to 13 hero locations. As more restaurants and frontline businesses sign up, they hope to expand through the county. I've always wanted to do something, I guess, philanthropic, but the, it, nothing ever just, nothing came to fruition. Well, this just kind of grew organically grassroots and the timing was right. For Alex, it gave her business the boost it needed to recover from the pandemic. It makes a lot of sense and it feels really good to, to be part of that program, so. ABC 10 News, Vanessa Paz. What a terrific idea. Now, if you have a story that is positively San Diego, we'd love to hear about it. Just email us at tips at 10news.com.